Hello everyone, you are welcome to solve this nice exponential equation, which is 9 to the power of x, this is equal to 900. What is the value of x given that x is not equal to 0? So let's prevent the solution from here. So we have 9 to the power of x, this is equal to 900. To solve for x here, we introduce logarithm on both sides so that now we have log 9 to the power of x this is equal to log 900 so log 9 to the power of x this is in the form of log a to the power of n which can be expressed as n log a now applying this power root property of logarithm then log 9 to the power of x becomes x log 9 this is equal to log 900. Therefore, let's divide both signs by log 9 and also here by log 9. So let's simplify here log 9 and log 9 so that x is equal to log 900 divided by log 9. So the next step from here is to express 900. This is the same thing as 100 times 9. Substituting this, then we have x is equal to rho 100 times 9. Everything here divided by rho 9. The next step is that rho 100 times 9, this is in the form of rho a times b, which we can express as rho a plus rho b. By applying this logarithm property, then we can express x as, this is rho 100 divided by rho 9, then plus rho 9 divided by rho 9. So that now, let's simplify rho 9 and rho 9 here, so this is 1. So that now, we have x here equal to 1 plus rho 100 divided by rho 9. 9. Now, the next step is that we can express 100 basically as 25 times 4. And we can express 9 as 3 to the power of 2. Substituting this, so by substituting this, we have x is equal to 1 plus, this is rho 25 times 4 divided by log 9, which is log 3 to the power of 2. Again, you find that log 25 times 4, this is in the form of log A times B, which you can express as log A plus log B. Now, here we have x is equal to 1 plus, this is log 25. So we have x is equal to 1, plus this is rho 25 over rho 3 to the power of 2 then plus here we have rho 4 divided by rho 3 to the power of 2 the next step is that we can express 25 as 5 to the power of 2 now substituting this then we have x is equal to 1 plus this is rho 5 to the power of 2 divided by rho 3 to the power of 2, then plus, we have rho 4, we can express rho 4 as rho 2 to the power of 2, divided by rho 9, which is 3 to the power of 2. The next step is to apply the power root property, that is rho a to the power of n, this can be expressed as n rho a. So, by applying this property, then we have x is equal to 1 plus 2 rho 5 divided by 2 rho 3 then plus 2 rho 2 divided by rho 3 to the power of 2 which is 2 rho 3. Now the next step from here we can simplify 2 and 2 here and also we have 2 and 2 here. So that now we have x equal to 1 plus 
this is rock 5 divided by rock 3 then plus rock 2 divided by rock 3 so that now rock 5 divided by rock 3 and rock 2 divided by rock 3 this is in the form of rock a divided by rock b which we can express as rock a to base b applying this property from here then we have x is equal to 1 plus this is rock 5 to base 3 then plus rock 2 to base 3 so this is the value of x this is the value of x from here the next step is to verify that this value of x actually satisfies the equation by following these steps now let's verify that the value of x here satisfies the equation now if you recall we have that 9 to the power of x this is supposed to give us a value of 900 so let's substitute the value of x so that we have 9 to the power of 1 plus rock 5 to base 3 then plus rock 2 to base 3 this should give us a value of 900 so we find that 9 to the power of 1 plus rock 5 to base 3 plus rock 2 to base 3 this is in the form of a to the power of n plus m which we can express as a to the power of n times a to the power of m so here we have 9 to the power of 1 times 9 to the power of rock 5 to base 3 then multiplying by 9 to the power of rock 2 to base 3 this should give us a value of 900 the next step from here we can express 9 basically as 3 to the power of 2 so let's substitute this so we have 9 times 3 to the power of 2 rock 5 to base 3 multiplying by 3 to the power of 2 rock 2 to base 3 this is supposed to give us a value of 900 the next step is that you find 3 to the power of 2 rock 5 to base 3 this is a power okay this is a power this is actually in the form of we have rock a to the power of n this is the same thing as n rock a so you find that 2 rock 5 to base 3 this is in the form of n this is in the form of n rock rock a so we can express in this form rock a to the power of n and that means that here we have 9 times 3 then rock 5 to the power of 2 so we express it in this form to base 3 then times 3 to the power of rock 2 to the power of 2 to base 3 this should give us a value of 900 so we have 9 times 3 to the power of rock 5 squared to base 3 this is in the form of a to the power of rock b to base a and this is equal to b so applying this power root property then you find that 3 this to the power of rock 5 to the power of 2 to base 3 this is equal to 5 squared and this is equal to 25 and 3 to the power of rock 2 squared to base 3 this is the same thing as 2 squared and this is equal to 4 so let's substitute this information here so we have 9 times 25 times 4 this is supposed to give us a value of 900 so we have 25 times 4 this is 100 times 9 so this is 900 and this is equal to 900 this implies that the left add side is equal to the right add side and this implies that the value of x which is 1 plus rock 5 to base 3 plus rock 2 to base 3 
actually satisfies the equation. So can you follow the steps? Like this video and subscribe. Like this video and subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye bye for now.